Many homeowners start and maintain gardens as hobbies, whether they're growing flowers or taking care of shrubbery, but despite the many different types of plants gardeners can grow, they all face one or many common challenges. Pest control. Aphids, snails, and other pests will consume or otherwise damage many garden variety plants, making this hobby all the more difficult to maintain. So in this video, we'll go over three common garden pests and what you can do to get rid of them. You can save on pest control with DIY products and do it fast with free same-day shipping from Solutions Pest and Lawn. To shop for the products featured in this video and to learn more about pest control, click the icon in the top right of the screen or click the link in the description below. Aphids are common parasitic pests that attack many outdoor plants as well as some indoor plants. They'll often attach themselves to stems, along new shoots, or underneath leaves. Once they've latched on, they'll begin to suck nutrients from the plant. Aphids are not just unsightly, but if left unattended, an aphid problem can cause wilting, discoloration, and leaf death. Before you use any of the products mentioned in this video or start any treatment, be sure to wear your personal protective equipment, or PPE, and remember to keep all people and pets off the treated areas until dry. To treat aphids on your plants, you can apply a bifenthrin-based liquid insecticide concentrate like Reclaim IT. When applied, the product leaves behind a long-lasting residual effect that kills many pests like aphids on contact. To kill aphids with Reclaim IT, you'll apply the product at the labeled rate of 0.25 to 0.5 fluid ounces per 1,000 square feet of treatment area. We recommend you use a 1-gallon handheld pump sprayer since it makes mixing and application quick and simple. To use a hand pump sprayer, open the sprayer, add half a gallon of water, and add your measured amount of product. Add the remaining half a gallon, close the sprayer, and shake to ensure an even distribution. Pump your sprayer a few times to produce a low-pressure spray. Treat your garden plants with a full-coverage foliar spray. Spray until leaves are thoroughly coated, and be careful not to over-apply to the point where the product drips off. When applied properly, aphids that make contact with the product's residual will be affected and die within the hour. Do not spray this product onto plants grown for consumption. Snails are mollusks that are frequent and annoying pests in many gardens. These shelled pests leave slime trails where they travel, and they also target many garden variety plants. They'll eat leaves, flowers, fruits, and ornamentals, creating unsightly holes and killing many plants. To get rid of snails on your property, you'll need to use a bait granule like Ficam. Ficam is an easy and ready-to-use bait that is labeled to treat and control snails in lawns and garden beds. Ficam contains the active ingredient orthoboric acid, a naturally occurring compound, and it's safe to use around children and pets when used according to label directions. To use Ficam, you'll spread it at a different rate depending on where you're applying it. To spread over your lawn, apply Ficam at a rate of 2 pounds per 1,000 square feet of treatment area. If you're spreading Ficam in a flower or ornamental garden bed, apply the product at a rate of 6 ounces per 100 square feet. You want to apply a thin layer of Ficam to the targeted area. Don't apply it in piles or clumps. After application, do not water in the granules. When applied properly, snails will consume the bait and die after several hours. Keep in mind, snails tend to hide upon death, so you're not likely to see dead snails scattered on your property. For best results, schedule your application so there is no rainfall in the foreseeable future. Japanese beetles are one of the most widespread turf and ornamental pests in the United States. As larvae, these insects can eat through plant roots and create large patches of dead grass, and as adults, they'll easily eat through plenty of garden leaves and cause mass defoliation. To get rid of Japanese beetles on your property, you'll need to use an insecticide labeled for Japanese beetle control, like Dominion 2L. Dominion 2L is a systemic insecticide that can be used to control larvae underneath turf as well as adults feeding on your garden plants. If you've found signs of grub activity, you'll need to broadcast a solution of Dominion 2L over your entire lawn at a rate of 0.46 to 0.6 fluid ounces per 1,000 square feet of treatment area. Since you'll need to make a high-volume treatment, we recommend you use a 20-gallon hose end sprayer to push your product down into the soil. To use the 20-gallon hose end sprayer, remove the reservoir from the nozzle, make sure the sprayer's control valve and your water pump are off, then attach the nozzle to the hose. Add the proper amount of Dominion 2L, then fill the reservoir with enough water to treat the entire lawn. To make sure you thoroughly coat the area and push the product into the soil, use at least 2 gallons of water per 1,000 square feet of treatment area. Double check to make sure your control valve and water pump are still off, then reattach the reservoir to the nozzle. Once you've ensured a tight connection, you can now turn the water on. 
To spray, push forward on the control valve. To stop, simply pull the valve back into the off position. To kill Japanese beetle grubs in your lawn, evenly distribute the entire amount of product over your treatment area. As you make your application, keep an eye on the amount of product you have left in the sprayer's reservoir. When the liquid in the reservoir runs out, no product will be applied. When applied properly, the product will absorb into the grass's roots. Grubs that eat the roots will then begin to die within 24 hours. If you're dealing with adults in your garden beds and other shrubbery, you'll instead mix 1.5 fluid ounces of product per 100 gallons of water. In a 20-gallon hose and sprayer, this is simplified to 0.3 fluid ounces of product per 20 gallons. With your 20-gallon hose and sprayer, you'll need to apply a foliar treatment to your garden plants and shrubs on your property. Be sure to spray leaves to the point of wet, but not runoff, ensuring that as much product sticks to the leaf surface as possible. Don't forget to treat the undersides of your leaves as well. When applied properly, the product will absorb into the treated plant's leaf tissue. Japanese beetles that consume the affected leaves will die within 24 hours. Gardening may be a fulfilling pastime for many homeowners, but our gardens can also attract a wide variety of pests. With these professional products and tips from Solutions Pest and Lawn, you can stop these common pests from invading your garden, and we offer same-day shipping to help you get control quickly. Visit our website to get your products today. If you like this how-to guide, please share, and if you're new to our channel, subscribe for more how-to and product videos. And contact us for more tips, tricks, and DIY pest solutions.